November 22nd, 2013. We're looking at stereo A. You can see Mercury and Earth come at inky. And now ISON has come into the same camera. I've been waiting on this so we could try to get some kind of comparison between uh, the size. We, we have a fixed size on inky. It's been around. They started watching it in the 1700s, guys. Now, ISON uh, is a new comet. So they started estimating this a long time ago. But Inky is say they say it's four point eight kilometers. That's the rock, the nucleus inside that, right? NASA estimates ISON at three point five kilometers. Here's the in miles, two point one miles compared to the top, two point nine miles. They're saying Inky is bigger than ISON. Now you say, well, maybe they're right because ISON appears closer to this camera. You think that's what they would say? I say ISON has to be at least 20 kilometers. I, I have not got a definite number on that size, but I can tell you this. It's much larger than 3.5. Notice Lovejoy in the top, 500 meters or half a kilometer. Look at the size of Lovejoy as it approached the sun. That's only 1,640 feet, guys, compared to 20 kilometers, which is 12.42 miles. Now, again, 20 is just, this is my first guesstimate on the size of the uh, nucleus. It may be larger. Each day we're going to get new numbers on this. But here's the problem, guys. Comet Inky is 24 million miles closer to this camera than ISON. ISON is not closer. So that reverses all everything. Now, I'll pull this up and we'll look at a close-up of it, guys. You notice how Inky's tail... Caught it just the way ISON did, the way we've been watching it on the red cameras. Now, this date is current. You're looking at ISON there after it's been stripped back. Imagine it coming into that camera before that giant comb was uh, torn away from it. Now, here's, here's how you uh, determine which one's closer. If you look at uh, the distance from the Earth, from Inky is 1.14 AU. Earth um, excuse me, I sun is 0.8. Now, um, stereo A is on the opposite side of the sun as Earth. So that's telling you we got a difference of 24 million miles. A is on the other side. I'm going to show you that diagram right here. Now, see, A and B form a triangle with Earth in the black box on the right. A is, I'm putting the location on the JPLs. Notice how much closer... Inky is to this camera. Inky is right beside Mercury. ISON is much closer to Earth from Mercury away from this camera. It's 24 million miles difference. Inky is 24 million miles closer on that camera than ISON, guys. And look how much bigger ISON appears to be. Now, again, that I gave a minimum estimate of 20 kilometers. That's just to, th to put something out there close it may be larger but again you we, all we have to compare that to in recent history on a large sun diver is love joy you remember so we're talking 40 times at a minimum of 20 kilometers 40 times the size of that now here these images go through the tent through the 14 but we have all the objects if you'll notice and the way this is set up, it's bouncing. So his eye sun is diving to the right. Lovejoy is going up and inky. See that angle up also? Notice these dates. This is eye sun coming in. Look how bright it gets. But this only is to the 14th. The flare hit it on the 19th. Okay? So this has all been stripped back. Also, guys, in the video last night, if you haven't seen it, where eye sun is stripped back by the X flare. Again, here's all three comets. The forward, you can see as I sun dives to the right, that's the correct motion of all three comets. But last night on the video, when you saw the tail strip back from I sun, you noticed that it made a wide Z pattern. Check out that video. What that did was increase the width of that debris trail by several hundred thousand miles. Think about it. And what is in that debris trail? And it was pushed push backwards. ISON has already crossed the Earth's orbital pattern that we're going to go through in mid-January. But this, that X-flare blew 
backwards. Everything was stripped backwards, probably at least a million miles, because that tw- the me- the uh, tail before it was hit was less to- made it at 12 million kilometers. All right, now, so we got a wider debris trail with a lot of objects in it. That's the point. Plus, I sign is much larger than they're saying. Heads up.